Welcome back to Everything House. We have a treat for you. Something that uh, we've been looking to buy. And uh, I'm excited about it. What do we got, Bart? Super excited about it. About it. And what do we got? Mm. <laughs> it's a late. <laughs> so, let's, uh, let's get to it. This is a, a WEN variable speed woodworking lathe. Uh, Bart has a project he's been wanting to do. What's that project? My project is a chessboard, and I want to make the pieces by hand. He's been egging me on to just buy the pieces, but no, I want to make them. I have, yeah. So, purchase a lathe. There's a lathe. Let's open this baby up. Is there a model number on this? Or is this one only make, oh, okay. So model, go ahead. Model 3421. Here's the instructions, we don't need them. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding, we need them. All right. We've got a lot of plastique. There's a lot of plastique. All right, ready? Ah. Okay. Okay. So, it's heavy. Uh, I think it's cast iron, and it, it, it feels like the real deal so far. So far, what is this? I don't know. Why don't you look at the instructions? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get to that. Oh, okay. So these are the bits. Ah, uh, yeah. That go at the end to hold. These are the bits that actually hold the piece you're working on. Okay. okay. Here's the other one. Yeah, that hold. That's one of them goes on one end, one of them goes on the other. We'll figure it out. I'm pretty sure this one is where it spins. Yeah, this, and this is, is just a holder. That makes sense. This is the turning piece. Okay, yeah, because this has teeth on it, and this is just just a, a comb. Yeah. These are some. We don't know yet. <laughs> Those are some brackets. More brackets. I'm assuming those go together. This is your stand, that's for this. This, is, this feels like it's stand. locked in. Is that supposed to be that way? What do you mean it's locked in? Look, it, it doesn't want to move. And there's, there's no bolt or anything underneath to release. I think it stays. Why is it? I don't know. Unless this is the unless this is the release. I think this is the piece that you hold your Oh like the this part of it. This. Mm. Hold your chisel. Oh. And you rest your chisel on this while you. Oh, it's super greasy. Oh yeah, it's all lubed up for it, you. It's mach it's machine it's machine uh, oil. Here's a wider, wider version of this. This looks about like six inch. Yeah, this is like four. Here's some tools. Yeah, we need the instructions, bro. There's a lot to this. I find there's a there's a lot going on here, bro. There's nothing else in the box, so that's what I just keep undoing the plastic. Oh, okay. This is your bracket. This goes onto there and holds something. Okay. I think you had it backwards. It's, it's possible. According to this first picture. Oh, from the first picture. In the first picture, it's definitely backwards. Alright. What else we got in packages? So this looks like it's a tool to tighten this down. It fits in here. Okay, this bracket. So that is a faceplate. That's what that's, this bit that you screwed on, that's called a faceplate? No, this is a butt plate. Faceplate. I know, I'm messing with it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a faceplate. <laughs> we can have our own name for it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Allen key. So I'm looking. Smaller Allen key. Things to lose. Great. Love it. <laughs> Things to lose. Uh, this looks like an adjustment knob or something. Okay, so assembly and adjustment. We're going to figure it out. Okay. What the hell is that? That's, this is an adjustment knob or something because it's got threads. It's right here. That's the key. It's got threads for on this. both sides. That's what it looks like in figure three. No, it doesn't go in there. No. See, it doesn't, it doesn't lock in. Well, well, maybe in this one. No, it doesn't lock in. But unless you want to rotate it by hand, maybe. 
Oh, see? see oh, wow. See, see, how, see how it does that? Yeah. It's because the motor has magnets, and the magnets want to be in a certain position. Pretty cool. Okay, oh, another use for it. Duh, yeah, I think this this is to hold hold that while you tighten this. Yes. Yes, that's, that's, that's what that is. They have the key see? that you are using. Yes. All right. Okay, that's fine. Okay, there's a spring. Oh, well, springs make me nervous. Me too. Took a PlayStation 4 controller apart once. They didn't know there were springs in it. Open it up and the two springs go ping ping. Good luck finding those. Oh, Took me an hour. Were those the uh Yes, the yes. Thumbs? For the, yeah, for the those, joystick. It was a notorious, like, yeah. yeah I, d I didn't know they were in there when I opened it and just something shot across the room and I'm just... Yeah, bye. Took me an hour to find them. Me and my friend. Is this one spring or no, it's just two springs? Yeah, that is two springs. Yes, yeah, well, we have two of them. Okay, oh, I got them apart. Okay. Okay, what is this? I don't see that. Where's that? That is this. You sure? No. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's the. Maybe it is? Alright, so all right, we got some instructions to read. I'm going to turn it off. We'll be right back when we have a little more handle of what's going on. Is that cool? That's cool with me. All right, cool. So six hours later, we're back. So six hours later, we're back. Got it all assembled. Yeah, but yeah, it wasn't terribly difficult if you know a little bit about how these work. Um, we're ready to turn on for the first time. You ready? I'm ready. All right, go ahead. <laughs> wow. It spins! Uh, it's on low. It is on low. Right. It's pretty cool, dude. <laughs> it looks like a lathe, man! We got a lathe. Alright. Cool. She spins. You, you got a, you got a rest here. You got. Alright, so yeah. let's let's go over it. Let me turn it off. Let's go over all the what we figured out. It rotated. It was, it was fairly simple to set up. I'm not a fan of the fact that I got to find a place to store all these things, right? Without losing yeah. them. Well, the Allen keys you can probably use the set, but you know, knock on knock on wood, knock on wood. Um, but we'll uh, we'll find some storage for it. A little box maybe may, would have been nice to hold everything, but. I'm, I'm picky when it comes to that stuff. Yeah, you are. I know. So, um, we were talking less. We were talking about these levers, and one ends up going right here, and it's it's called what's it called tool tool rest lock. Yeah. So once you pop that in, you can loosen this up, so you can set where to put your tool rest. That's pretty much what it is. So you can set it up how you like. How far it, away? It's very adjustable. It's actually pretty cool. Um, and then once you get it where you like, just go ahead and tighten it down, and ah, and there you go, and you move it. And that's tight. And also, yes. So this lever right here releases the tool rest. Yeah, that makes sense. So you can spin it. So like how how he was okay, nice. You you turning it left or right, then you can adjust this so that you're straight with whatever you're working on. However you want to do it. Yeah, this is really really nice. It's, it's, I'm surprised how quickly we got it going. Right, yeah. right out of the box, because you and I both have no experience with lathes whatsoever. No experience whatsoever. We saw yeah. a bunch of videos on it, and it's like, that's cool, one day. That's cool, one day. And one day. There was no one day. And today's the day. It is the day. No. Okay. Um, all right. So on the back here, the other lever, this one, this one releases the, what is it called, tailstock. And this slides back and forth freely now. But once you get it to the piece, well, actually, this is how you're supposed to do it, from what I know. So you should, oh, wait, hold on. There's another step. So this okay. tightens the life center, right? And you untwist it, and it goes back. So you, I'm assuming you're supposed to start it all the way back. Yeah, that makes sense. Get yourself to your piece, lock that in, and then screw this in so that it's nice and tight towards the stock. 
the face plate and the I don't know whatever you're cutting the stock yes or, or toward this face plate yes so you screw that tight nice and tight and you also lock this in this locks in your bit from well I mean I don't know how it would fly out but I'm sure it's there for a reason it's there for a reason it's, well it's a safeguard safe it's orange it means caution is that what it means usually <laughs> it does say warning in orange right here there you go um anything else that we missed um no uh did we show them that warning yep we did right yep all right cool um yeah so that's low setting how many sp how many speeds i'm pretty sure no, it it's, says. Like, there's a little knob here it's a knob but it's and from it, low to high as you rotate it i'm pretty sure i skipped it over here somewhere it said I want to get in the face with this thing. Come on, watch out. Oh, that's high. That's high? And as you can see, we're not centered at all. We are not. No, it's, it's moving back and forth but like an eighth of an inch or more. Yes, but essentially you're, you could, you don't have to have a perfectly square piece when you start. No, but it doesn't hurt. It helps. It helps. Alright. You want to grab a chisel and start you, do you want to grab a chisel and start? Do you not feel safe about it? No, I don't want to touch it at all. And it's not even a real lazy chisel. It is not. So what happens? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me get the safety skins. Yeah, put, the, put these out at least, okay? Yeah, see if it was Nice and clean. Right, let's get this nice and square. All right. First. Oh, yeah, that's a sharp edge. Like like a chip cutting chip. I feel like this is gonna knock down because it's spinning this way. Okay. I I have I've never used one. I know nothing about them, Bart. Oh my god, okay, I'm kind of nervous. Okay, maybe we're close to it. Uh, ah, look at that! Hold on, go back to it. Now you pick up less at a time. Less at a time. I'm trying. I know, I know. Maybe it's moving too closer. I am. No, 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 no. There's, there's a rest, so it's not so. Oh, like liquidity. Slow it down. Okay. Stir it off. Oh, so it's chewing away. Yeah. Okay, cool. Okay, let's get down so that we're kind. Of, it's a circle. It's centered, yeah. Let's see how. It's gonna take a minute. It's gonna take a minute. There you go. See. Now closer, there's less of a chance to like push you around. Oh, hey, if you move it to the side. You're working. This yeah. little, this little thing is nice. This is amazing. Okay, here we go. All right. All right. It's on high. This is so cool. <laughs> it is, right? Yeah. Just wait when you're looking at it and the little groove you see it moving as you're pressing in on it. Yeah. So right here I think we're already at a circle. Yeah. You want to try? Yeah. Right? Here. Safety uh, spins. Yeah. Oh, you don't need them, huh? <laughs> Just for the guinea pig? Yep. I want to see what we got. I want to see what we got. Not even close. Not around. even close. Oh my god, look at this thing, dude. It's it's still square. It's still square. Oh, actually just this side is not square from from what I did. Wow. It's not even close, dude. But dude come on, give me like No, I'm not, I'm not holding anything against you. I'm just just 70 
A I'm percent of it is round. When it's spinning that fast, it looks round. It looks round. Like, wow. So we know we're not round when it's when you have those high kicks. Because if it was round, it wouldn't be doing that. That's gotta be round. Do you think that's round? I do. Almost. All right. A couple flat spots, but we're getting there. But we're definitely getting there with some practice, I think. That is botched. They're taking out huge chunks. I think that's that's just a. <laughs> you think it's the chisel? Pardon. Huh? You think it's the chisel, or just the wood? No, it's the chisel. It's not the right tool. Yeah. It's nowhere near the right tool. Yeah. But if you're looking to get a benchtop blade that's pretty simple, just set up and go. I mean, not even seven and a half minutes, and we're. Lay that away. We're laving away. Yeah. So once we get some a little bit, figure out a little, a little better, we'll uh, have an update. Have an update. So the next, the reason why I bought it is to make the chess pieces. So once we get better at it, yeah. Trying to create chess pieces like this one. Stay tuned. Stay tuned.